Test for copper 2 ion. First step is observation. The color of this copper 2 ion salt is blue. Second step, dissolve n full spatula of salt in 50 milliliters of water. When salts of copper 2 ion dissolve in water, they form blue solution. Chemicals required 1. Sodium hydroxide solution 2. Sodium carbonate solution 3. Diluted ammonia 4. Potassium iodide 5. Sodium thiosulfate 6. Potassium hexacyanoferrate 7. Concentrated hydrochloric acid 3rd step, divide the solution into test tubes, put around 5 milliliters in each test tube. Preliminary tests To the first test tube, add sodium hydroxide solution dropwise until in excess. As you see, Sodium hydroxide react with copper 2 ion to form blue precipitate, which is insoluble in excess of sodium hydroxide. Below, there is ionic equation for this reaction. To the second test tube, Add sodium carbonate solution dropwise until in excess. As you see, sodium carbonate reacts with copper 2 ion to form blue precipitate, which is insoluble in excess of sodium carbonate. Below, there is ionic equation for this reaction. Confirmatory tests First confirmatory test. To the third test tube, add ammonia solution dropwise until in excess. As you see, ammonia react with copper 2 ion to form blue precipitate, which is soluble in excess of ammonia to form deep blue solution. Below, there is ionic equation for this reaction. Second confirmatory test. To the fourth test tube, add few drops of potassium iodide solution followed by sodium thiosulfate. As you see, potassium iodide react with copper 2 ion to form white precipitate and iodine which appear as brown solution. Iodine produced react with sodium thiosulfate then brown color of iodine is removed. White precipitate of copper 1 iodide remains in the test tube. Below, there is ionic equation for this reaction.
Third confirmatory test. To the fifth test tube, add few drops of potassium hexacyanoferrate solution. As you see, potassium hexacyanoferrate react with copper 2 ion to form brown precipitate. Fourth confirmatory test. To the sixth test tube, add excess of concentrated hydrochloric acid. As you see, Concentrated hydrochloric acid react with copper 2 ion to form yellow solution. Below, there is ionic equation for this reaction. Summary of this experiment. Observation. The color of salt is blue. The blue color of salt indicates that, the cation present in salt, is transitional metal cation. To the first test tube sodium hydroxide is added dropwise. The cation that forms blue precipitate with sodium hydroxide and precipitate is insoluble in excess of sodium hydroxide is copper 2 ion and cobalt 2 ion. To the second test tube sodium carbonate solution is added dropwise. The cation that forms blue precipitate with sodium carbonate solution and precipitate is insoluble in excess of sodium. Carbonate solution is copper 2 ion. Confirmatory tests. First confirmatory test. To the third test tube ammonia solution is added dropwise. The cation that forms blue precipitate with ammonia solution and precipitate is soluble in excess of ammonia to form deep blue solution, is copper 2 ion. Copper 2 ion is confirmed. The cation present in the salt is copper 2 ion. Second confirmatory test. To the fourth test tube, Potassium iodide solution is added followed by sodium thiosulfate. The cation that forms white precipitate mixed with brown solution of iodine, when potassium iodide is added, the cation is copper 2 ion. Copper 2 ion is confirmed. The cation present in the salt is copper 2 ion. Third confirmatory test. To the fifth test tube, Potassium hexacyanoferrate solution is added. The cation that forms brown precipitate with potassium hexacyanoferrate is copper 2 ion. Copper 2 ion is confirmed. The cation present in the salt is copper 2 ion. Fourth confirmatory test. To the sixth test tube, concentrated hydrochloric acid is added. The cation that forms yellow solution with concentrated hydrochloric acid is copper 2 ion. Copper 2 ion is confirmed. The cation present in the salt is copper 2 ion. In the description there are links for testing other cations and anions. Subscribe for more videos and leave your comments below. Thank you for watching.